Whatever you do, don't look behind you. Run! Welcome back to our next indie game, Arachno Escape, a journey through the gut. <laughs> so I guess we were just a poor, innocent, sweet little demon, I mean spider, chilling on a slice of pizza, and we got gobbled up by the dude, and now we need to find a way to escape his innards. Okay, got it. Here we go. Oh my god. The inside of this guy's mouth is horrifying. It's just random teeth and random places, green shit everywhere. What look at these look at this tooth I'm sitting on. It's not one tooth. It's like two teeth fused and bridged together and it's the same same for this one. I can't imagine a game with a spider where the spider is not the most terrifying thing in it, but I think the inside of this guy's body has got the spider trumped. Alright. Here we go. section. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know what's going in, on inside this guy's body, but he, he needs to get to a doctor, because there's some freaky ass shit going on. It's just like way too many ribs and they're just floating around loose which I'm pretty sure isn't normal damn it Yes, we've arrived in his stomach. We've we've traveled through his horrifying mouth, down his throat, and now we're in his gut, which has random fish skeletons literally bolted to the side of it with metal braces. <laughs> Alright. Sure. 
Let's get to the... Uh, the very end, safe from these flying shit, so I can get to the... Ah, okay. Okay. Alright, calm down with it. Swallowing shit. We need to... So, yeah, if we, if we get right up against... We'll be safe. For each one. Alright. That bottom fish skeleton is being held onto his stomach by a band-aid. Yep, nothing wrong with this guy. Well, not at all. Perfectly normal gut condition. Oops, about lost that one. And there's half-eaten chicken leg, whole chicken bone, a toy boat. What appears to be a giant key. What? Oh, the, the level of it got too high. I see. Crap. Gotta wait for a break. In the Oop. Can I just walk off this side? Is that a thing? No. Not gonna let me cheat. Alright. Uh, I didn't mean to fall off the end. I was trying to go forward. I fucked it up. I saw the stomach acid level was coming up, and I tried to go back, and then... was that a key in his gut. It's a partially eaten key. What's that condition where people have an obsession with eating inedible shit? Because I think this guy's got it. Find all the ingredients and escape. <laughs> Detonator, explosives, and a wire. Why are these things in this guy's stomach? Okay, whatever. There's the detonator right there. Now we're after the explosives, which are right there. How do I get around to that? Is that this way? Yep. And there's the wire over there. F to detonate. Uh, all right. So did we blow our way out of his gut, or did we just blow up ourselves? 
Yes, little spider. Put on your Blues Brothers sunglasses and saunter off into the sunset with a smoke. After you fucking detonated your way out of this guy's stomach with the explosive materials that were inexplicably just hanging out in his fucking <laughs> his intestines for some reason. Oh. That I can I can press F to just keep detonating. This guy ate me. I want to make sure there's nothing left of him. Ah. <laughs> uh. That might be the oddest game that I've ever played. <laughs> but I like it. That was pretty that was pretty neat. You know, I I don't really know what that was so bizarre, like there's just weird shit in the guy's stomach, all of his organs and bones are in the wrong places. It's just just keys and gunpowder and detonators and, you know, detonator wires just right there in case, you know, something needs to blow its way out of his gut for some reason, and, ugh, alright, well, <laughs> that was Arachno Escape, Journey Through the Gut, thank you for watching, as always, you want to play that for yourself, of course, the link is in the description, like that if you liked it, dislike it if you don't. I'll see you in the next one.